Welcome back everybody and hello to every single new visitor. It's your favorite German potato and this is the Hot Wheels Bone Shaker. The car which you can get via the Forza Thun shop in this autumn season guys. Trust me it's awesome, it's one of the best A-class cars. Here's why. 6.8 speed, 7.0 handling, 9 at acceleration, 10 launch, 7.5 braking, 408 HP, 1023 kilogram. Is it as good as the stats say? Let's race with my community. And like always, the tune is uploaded to my storefront and part of the setup spreadsheet which you can find in the description of the video. Where am I starting? Behind a Shelby Data uh, Cobra Daytona. Okay, one of the best A-class cars already in this lobby, in my community lobby. Uh, take a look at the acceleration of this bone shaker. Isn't it impressive? Yes, guys, that's probably even uh, already the main reason why this car is so good, because of its acceleration. So Team Blue versus Team Red once again in this video and whoa okay let's get closer to him here okay but yeah the speed of the car is not the best I can also tell you this guys the speed is not the best and now I see we probably had the same track last time for, uh, in the first race right <laughs> no Johnson why are you setting up um, this lobby like this anyway guys the acceleration and the handling for fast speed turns is great in this car. Or let's say for mid speed turns. Mid speed turns. That's where the car is shiny. Uh, but as you can see, the speed, well, it could Don't. be better. Oh, oh, everybody's slightly late here. But we survive. We survive. It's still very, very close. Oh, the Shelby the, um, Cobra is back. The Shelby Cobra is back. It's on. It's intense, guys. Okay. Is it that intense? I don't know. Nah, guys, it wasn't that intense. Easily winning the first race. Damn, the Bone Shaker is OP. This race, guys, is going to be a Johnson challenge. Means I let every single one pass and try to win this race. So here we go, guys. Okay, let's go. Let's go, guys. Let's go. I'm on 10th now, right now. It's the Cotswold Super Sprint. Um, I know this track pretty well already now. And let's see, guys. Let's see. Let's check the awesome acceleration of this Bone Shaker. I wouldn't say it's mu as much as um, as much OP as the Alpha Stradale, for example, or yeah, maybe the Shelby Daytona, or the Honda NSX. But it's a very, very, very good car in A class, especially on these kind of tracks. And if we have these kind of corners here, the car is just shining, as you can see already. Oh, the P4 guy got prompt. Oh my God! <laughs> Probably not the best car for you. I remember being. Uh, I remember being. I remember being. OP in Forza Motorsport 7, but I don't think it's just as OP um, in Horizon anymore. Okay, let's see if we can have the inside here. Yes! Awesome line, awesome line, overtaking my community, guys. If you want to be part of those races, simply join our Discord server and you can be part of the recording sessions. And don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe if you like what you see. Well, 48% of the track are over and, well, there's not so much to come actually. Um, it's just straight on from here now. So I probably won't ri uh, win this race. But hey, I think position number three seems to be good as well. Or, uh, well, I think my car is going to be faster than yours. So let's see uh, what the top speed of this car says after this part. Since, well, it's a very, very quick part, very fast part. But yeah, the top end of the car is not the best. It's all about acceleration and handling. And tell me in the comment section, guys, how do you like this car? And I actually hope you have enough Forza Thumb points for this car to get. So here we go. We're closely next to you. We're, oh, God, okay. Oh, we're taking him on the outside. Oh, no. <laughs> well, touching the wall slightly. And, well, this is probably position number two, it seems. Yes. But Team Red is still winning versus Team Blue in this race. Johnson Challenge almost succeeded. Almost. It's the Prince's Garden Street Circuit. Actually, one of my favorite tracks in the game. And, well, it's another Johnson Challenge time in this, uh, on this track, guys. It's a pure handling track. So let's see how the Bone Shaker is actually performing here versus the community. Okay, Alpha Stradale in front of me. Probably the best handling car in A-Class. And he's last right now. What's that? <laughs> Uber, what's that? Uber in his goal. You were just told me on Discord, Johnson, please stop waiting for me. 
Okay, Mark and White in the lead. He's in Team Red. Nice. That's awesome. Well, Rio is next to me and we also... Just close. Oh my god, next to this BMW M2 coupe. <laughs> Guys, you're parking on the apex. You're parking in the middle of the road. <laughs> Guys, what are you doing? Oh, nice Lotus 11, guys. Nice Lotus 11. Oh, I think you shouldn't take this car here, especially in A-Class. Okay, guys, one lap is over and already third. Oh, God. Where's where's my competition this time, you know? Where's Grandma driving? Where's Rio? Where's Crop Lord? Hello, Majestics. How's it going? And we're behind Mark now. We're behind Mark. The only one right now who's actually giving me some competition here in the Shelby Daytona. The car which also Grandma was driving against me when I was racing the Alpha Stradale, guys. If you want to see the best A-Class Cars video, check the info card now for some crucial insight, guys. Uh, the Bone Shaker is definitely part of it, but also this Shelby Daytona Cobra. And here we go. What's up, Mark? What's up, Mark? Can you handle the Johnson pressure? That's the most important question now. And we've got him. After two laps, guys, I am in the lead. So as you can see, ladies and gentlemen, this car is also working perfectly on such a handling track in A-Class. Well, I was searching for some dirt racing cars, some very, very good ones, especially in S1 class, guys. Then check the info card now. The Glen Rennock Hillside Sprint, and I'm actually starting from last. The game knows it. Johnson needs this challenge in this, in this OP bone shaker. Okay, overtaking the Skyline and the S2000 and so on and so on. The acceleration of this car is just so amazing. <laughs> oh man, I see everyone um, just, yeah, going to drive with this bone shaker in the future. After this Bye, have a great time. Oh, where is he going? <laughs> where is Benjamin going? <laughs> have you seen this? What the hell is going on with him? <laughs> okay, hunting Mr. Huiro in his focus now. Oh. It's so slow, why did you change the car, buddy? And now, Mark in the lead again in this Shelby. And we're behind Tedpool, rocking the BMW. The Glen Renault Hillside Sprint, a very, very cool track in this game, actually. 37% are over. One minute in the race, and I'm not first. Okay, and here we go, Deadpool, what's up? Okay, guys. I want to catch him before we reach 70%. What do you think? Can I do it? 53%, 54, 55. Okay, I need some corners here. I need some corners, guys. Oh, okay, 60% now. 60%. Can I get him? That's the question. 61%. Oh my god, no! No, I can't. <laughs> I was breaking too much for him. No! Oh, damn it. No! 70% challenge failed. Uh, and now he's wall bashing. And now we got him. 74% are over. No! And the race is over! <gasps> Winning once again. The Lakers Cup Circuit. Okay, it's rainy, guys. As you can see, the track is slightly rainy. And the acceleration of this car, I just love it so much. <laughs> the launch! The launch is just, I do know. the best one of this class. It's a handling car. And well, from second to last to third, I'm a wizard. In one corner, and I'd say one combination, Mr. Benjamins. <laughs> Please, uh, yeah, just don't drive into the landscape again, just like you did before. Um, I mean, it was looking amazing me, but yeah, take a look at it. But yeah, the Lotus 11 seems to be very, very quick on straight, as you can see. We're behind him. We're behind Benjamins. Is he doing something funny? Okay, he isn't. Okay, let's wait, guys. Let's wait. That's just boring. Let's do it. Okay, so I wait until I'm 
fifth? Okay. No, I'm sixth now. I think I'm sixth now. Oh, no, why is he last? What's going on there? Okay, now it's changing. Nice light. So I'm on the Super GT position now on sixth. So, can Super GT actually win this race? That's the most important question now. What's up, buddy? Oh, oh. That was John's dive from... Oh, and he missed the checkpoint. He clearly missed the checkpoint. Goodbye, buddy. Why isn't he respawning? Oh my god, he was clearly missing it. The lag is real. Oh, the load is 11. Oh. <laughs> oh god. Uh, that's not the stock engine in this Lotus. It's definitely not the stock engine. Okay. One lap to go, guys. One lap to go. I'm third. Can I win this race? Oh, from, uh, from sixth? I don't know. I'm definitely catching Tadpole. But... Can I get Ryuru? I mean, his car is so slow at the straight. We've seen it before, so let's see. Okay. Oh, I can do it, guys. I can do it in one lap. Okay. Let's take the inside here. Yes, nice. Okay, let's hope that Tedpool is leaving me some space. Yes, he is. Okay. Two corners left. Closing it! He's closing the closing the door. Okay, from the outside now. Full throttle. Nope. Oh, he's wrecking me! <laughs> Such a bastard. And that's it for today, ladies and gentlemen. Many Johnson challenges in this video, but I think you've seen how awesome this car is. Get it through the Forza Fun Shop, guys. You won't regret it. Um, don't forget to smash the like button if you like what you see, don't forget to subscribe if you're new, don't forget to click the bell to get notified when I'm uploading new videos, and don't forget to tell me in the comment section, guys, which other cars you want me to use in future videos. I see you next time.